Roy Keane finally gets Man United wish with Ten Hag ready to boot flop out the door. Roy Keane might just have his Manchester United wish to come true ahead of Eric Ten Hag's arrival at the club. Aaron Juan Bissaka has been frequently criticised by the Red Devils legend after a disastrous season at Old Trafford. The Red Devils could finish as low as seventh this year and are on course for their lowest points haul ever in the Premier League. One of the most damaging reasons why is because of their shocking defensive form with the likes of Harry Maguire, Victor Lindelof and Rafael Varane, signed from Real Madrid last year, all coming under fire. Another that has been savaged, though, has been Juan Bissaka. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer stuck by the full back until he was sacked, and the arrival of Ralf Rangnick has signaled the end of that particular policy after ostracizing him from the first team picture. The 24-year-old has made just seven Premier League appearances since the German arrived to replace Ole Gunnar Solskjaer earlier in the season. Diogo Dalot has been preferred over the former Crystal Palace star, who now looks set to leave this summer after Ten Hag decided that he does not figure in his plans, according to Sky Sports. Where Juan Bissaka will end up by the end of the summer remains to be seen, but there will be jubilation from United icon Keane. Who should Manchester United sign in the transfer window this summer? Comment below the Irishman has pinpointed the right back as one of the main causes of United's shoddy defensive showings over the season when he has played. Solskjaer's penultimate game against Liverpool, where the Red Devils were crushed 4-0 saw Keane blow steam in the Sky Sports studio. Speaking about the defender, he said, Juan Bissaka, I don't even think Crystal Palace would take him back now. He's not good enough for Manchester United. No feel for the ball. No decision making. But what Manchester United have always had over the years, no matter talented players, is players with character and personalities. I don't see it with this group. That was not the only incident when Manchester City thrashed United 4-1 in March after Rangnick handed Juan Bissaka a rare start but he failed to seize that chance and ended up on the wrong end of another keen rant. He said, City are a fantastic team, and that's why they are champions. You hope the subs who came on would have an impact, but they're not prepared to run around, couple of lads in midfield, Juan Bissaka, Fred, Maguire, Rashford, I could go on. You've got to run back, and you've got to tackle. United players have shown quality over the years, but we've seen a reflection of where the team is and where the club is 